Hey guys, this is Crafty Fox, and today I'm going to show you how to build the Pennsylvania Railroad 1223, and it's a steam locomotive, a class D16 SB, and it also served on the Strasburg Railroad. And uh, this was a train request by Catch a Train Rail Fan Productions, who commissioned the build. Uh, you can commission builds on Cellify.com, and I'll basically build any train you want in Minecraft for two dollars. And this is actually my second uh, train commission. The first one was the Swedish X2. So thank you guys for supporting my channel. And uh, let's get started. So first off, let's make the front plow of nether brick stairs, three blocks wide. Then behind that, let's add some stone brick slab. We're gonna make that five blocks long. And then we're gonna take nether brick slab, just to add that a row on top of the stone brick. Uh, five blocks wide like that and then take stone brick add uh, three blocks on top like so and on the sides of it let's add some nether brick stairs then we're gonna take uh, black wool just add four so one two three four make it three blocks wide and then just add two black wool to the sides over here and this is going to be for the piston and let's take nether brick slab just add that uh, on the bottom like so and let's add the wheels so we're going to have these tiny little wheels in the front just two hoppers per wheel and um, in the middle here we're going to have stone brick on the sides but you can't really see it because this nether brick is covering it so it should look like that and let's do the other side all right so after we do that let's take some gray wool and <laughs> i'm just gonna guess just add like seven so one two three four five six seven yeah, let's go okay. <laughs> and then we're gonna add stone brick stairs right here to the back. We're gonna start making these uh, driving wheels. So they're just gonna be two by twos of stone brick stairs in a, like a circle. Just have that on either side. And we're gonna leave a gap of two between the two driving wheels. So just skip these two blocks, start the second one or the front one the same thing alright then let's add uh, more detail with the someone told me what this is called <laughs> what it was called a rod sorry I can't remember just make the rod that makes the wheels move you know so we're gonna add uh, iron uh, trap door should add three and then we're gonna add a uh, stone slab all the way to the back wheel the front of the back wheel and let's do the same thing on the other side so it should look like that alright then we're gonna go over here let's take some nether brick uh, stairs just add it upside down just two of them upside down right here All right, then let's uh, start making the head. So we're gonna take uh, polished andesite, just add that to the middle. Make it three blocks like that, and uh, let's make a cross shape so it looks like this. And just continue it for three blocks long. And let's add some stone brick stairs so we're gonna have the first ones it's gonna curve like that so we're gonna face it towards the front while the secondary ones they're gonna be curving like that so we have to do the bottom so temporarily remove that part so we can just add that in All right, then let's add a nether brick fence over here. Just for that diagonal line that goes down. And then let's add a coupling 
right over here. Let's take another brick slab just to have that sticking out right above the plow. And uh, then let's add this part. So that's going to be five blocks long. So let's take some nether brick stairs and a black wall. So extend that by five. So one, two, three, four, five. And just connect the rest just do the same thing as you did in the front with the stairs just having this nice curved cylinder all right then we're gonna have uh, this part so we're gonna make that two blocks long and just completely with the black hole and make it kind of like boxy like that and let's go to the front let's add the light so we're just going to have this black wall and then we're going to add another brick slab underneath it and then let's take an item frame and uh, white stained glass for the light just add that right in the front <clears throat> then let's take another brick uh, stairs add that behind the light and on top of that let's add an iron bar sticking up and I have no idea what that is Let's have uh, the chimney, a smokestack, whatever you want to call it. Just add two of them, polish and a site. And then let's add a skeleton skull right over here. And this is supposed to represent the bell. And then let's have black wall, skip one, black wall, and then uh, another brick stairs. And on top of that, let's add a oak wood fence like so. And uh, let's work on the cab. So we're going to add uh, three more or maybe, oh, it's four more. So we're going to go stick out from the side and add four. So one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. You just match it up and fill in the floor with the black wall. Maybe we could fill in these three over here. And let's add the stairs. So we're going to add another brick stairs like that. And then an upside down one and then another brick slab and let's do the same thing on the other side like so and let's add some gray wall to the bottom just to connect to the back tender I think <laughs> I'm pretty sure it does somehow it's like a coupling almost actually let's make the coupling stone brick uh, slab just add that it's kind of weird how it is so wait does it continue all the way no it doesn't so just make that three blocks long and let's add some more a uh, black wall over here uh, you want to make this segment um, 11 blocks long so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 uh, go all the way make this up uh, perimeter I would say and you could fill in the floor in just black wool all right and then go towards the back and let's add this segment so we're going to use uh, stairs on the sides upside down of course so we have like this sort of a ladder and we need nether brick stairs or nether brick slab underneath the stairs just to make this back platform all the way across and one over here that's supposed to be the coupling all right then let's take uh, some more black wool to make the rest of the tender and uh, let's add two more layers maybe actually three more layers so just add three more blocks of height towards the back tender actually <laughs> uh, remember to leave this ledge alone I forgot that so we're just going all the way around and let's go or to go towards the back let's add uh, this uh, sort of uh, I don't know what that is actually it just helps you with the ladder like some kind of railing just have this nether brick uh, fence go all the way around towards the top and that's going to be right in the middle 
and alongside that to the left of it let's add a ladder going all the way up and uh, let's add this nether brick uh, slab just have that right here you gotta leave that block alone just go all the way around again and then let's go um, add this light in the back we're gonna add black wool and let's see an item frame and a white stained glass pane and I'm just seeing how it's going along which is pretty good alright then let's add the rest of the cab so we're gonna add sort of this U shape we'll leave two holes in there two blocks <laughs> and uh, we're gonna add a uh, smooth sandstone to it just for decoration and uh, we're also gonna make the back part where it probably says I think the number right here so that's gonna be a 2x2 two two alongside the bottom so it's gonna be like imagine there's 2x2 two two here and then we just go right there that's where we're gonna start the logo and uh, it's gonna be a uh, five blocks long so two three four five let's do both sides so, come on and then let's add coal to it so we're gonna take a block of coal just go right over here next to the nether brick slab just alongside it on the top should get continue all this coal and since this is a steam train of course you need coal to power the engine yeah let's add a uh, black wool wall over here so the coal doesn't just fall over all right then let's add uh, some more black wool so we're gonna add a little wall over here two blocks tall and let's take uh, gray stained glass just add that to the corners of the front of the cab and also right here towards the back let's have some windows here and they also have like this red window well it's not really red but the window frame is red so that's why I think it would be easier just make a red uh, stained pane right there let's add uh, black wool in the gaps make a wall over here and uh, let's add some more black wool top of here and here too and let's take another brick slab just add that alongside and we're gonna overhang by two blocks and also add that continuing the cab HUD <laughs> I don't even know what I'm saying the cab roof all right, then we're gonna have like this weird pattern here, and you'll be like, "Why?" And actually, <laughs> never mind. We're gonna leave that alone. We're just gonna have the overhang that's another brick slab, so it should look like that. And we're gonna make it even better, just adding a black carpet to the very top of the cab. All right. So after we do that, let's add um, some more nether brick slabs. So we're going to add that one right here, just adjacent to this pillar, which is a smokestack. And then we're going to continue this line of nether brick slab all the way to the cab. And do the same thing on the other side. And then we're going to remove these uh, black wool and just replace that with the slabs. Alright, so let's work on the wheels. So go towards the back, and we're going to have like these two bogies. And I think they're called bogies. Are they? Yeah, they should work like them, right? Or maybe not. I don't know what I'm talking about. Anyways, we're going to add a uh, hopper. So this time we're going to add one hopper for the wheel. One hopper here, each side, then two 
uh, stone brick slabs on either side, then hopper again, then skip to. And do the same thing, right? Hopper. Hopper. And you can see that's how it looks like. Alright, so next thing we're going to do is um, add this little detail, which is just a fence on the side right there adjacent to that stairs and it's like one of the little details <laughs> like you never really notice until you really study it it's not on the other side though alright so let's add more detail through the front we're gonna add a red stained clay in the middle and add stone uh, buttons around it and that's how you make the Pennsylvania Railroad 1223 I hope you guys enjoyed that video and thanks again to catch a train rail fan productions uh, for commissioning the build really helps my channel and if you guys like this video please hit that like button below and subscribe if you have already because I will be uploading more videos in the future and uh, we have the flying Scotsman on the way if you guys are interested in that it's another commission which I'll see in another video so anyways guys I'll see you guys later